if your iPhone has any sort of problem which can't be fixed by doing a restore then you have to get go into something called the DFU mode it works on iPhones, iPod touches and iPods and it also works on computers and Macs, the procedure is just the same so it doesn't matter if you see the USB cable plugged into iTunes or if your iPhone keeps on having the Apple logo and then it switches off again usually the DFU mode can fix that so what you have to do is plug it into your computer once you've done that is you switch it off either by holding the power button for a long time and sliding across or you hold both buttons and it will be switching off once it's switched off still plugged into your computer once it's switched off you have to press the power button and the home button at the same time keep holding it the Apple logo will light up and once the Apple logo goes away again it seems like the phone is switched off let go of the power button but keep holding the home button after about seven seconds your computer will respond even though the screen is dark I'll just show you this so I'll just switch it off by pressing both buttons now it's switched off now I hold both buttons there's the Apple logo and now it's dark I let go of the power button but I keep holding the home button I don't let go of that and now there's my message that iTunes has detected an iPhone recovery mode even though the screen's completely dark from here you either hit restore or you hit the uh, you hit the alt key which is this one if you hit the alt key and then you hit restore then it will prompt you and ask you where you want to get your file from you only have to do that if you want to jailbreak your device and you're doing it with a custom firmware if you don't do any jailbreaking just hit restore and that will be fine usually this should fix all your problems